Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in this quick video, I would like to show you how you can share a video in SharePoint uh, at a specific uh, time within the video. Uh, let me explain to you what I'm talking about. So I happen to have some video files here uh, sitting in the SharePoint document library. By the way, the trick I'm about to show you uh, also works for videos in OneDrive. And uh, let me click on one of those uh, videos. Here it is. And um, it's a quick video. And when you share, try to share the video, um, you can share and, you know, or copy a link, a pretty much similar way you would share uh, a regular file from a SharePoint document library. Uh, and essentially when users, you know, click on that link, uh, it will start playing the video uh, from, you know, the starting point, right? Uh, from uh, the, you know, essentially uh, first second of the video. Uh, now, what if, what if I have a very long video and I want to maybe, you know, share at a specific time within the video? So let's say it's, uh, again, an hour long uh, Teams recording, you know, meeting, maybe some sort of town hall and you want uh, maybe to share at a specific time. Uh, let me, for example, do something like this. I want to share uh, this video with uh, my recipients, um, you know, starting with second five. Uh, here's how you do it just uh, move, um, you know, essentially the bar uh, to the starting point to of, you know, where you want the video to start for the user uh, and click share. And you're going to see another option appearing over here, copy link at current time. And essentially it will copy the link. By the way, uh, it works the same way, right? Um, just like a, you are sharing a file, you can specify the type of link, um, also set an expiration date. Let's not worry about it. Let's accept the default link. Uh, click apply. And uh, let me show you what the experience will be for the users. Now, um, I'm not going to open another, uh, you know, kind of uh, window and log in as another user. I'm just going to, you know, paste that URL. I just copied and look at this. Uh, when the user, you know, essentially clicks on the link, they click the play button. You will notice it starts uh, not you know, uh, from, uh, you know, the first second of the video, it started from, uh, you know, the fifth second of the video. So essentially, it brings the user right into um, the exact time within the video. Uh, so that's all I really wanted to show you in this, um, uh, in this quick tutorial. Hopefully, uh, you found it useful. As always, uh, happy to see you on my blog, sharepointmaven.com, uh, as well as my YouTube channel. Goodbye.